fun and it is uh, addicting because I love bakery goods. Um, I mean, being Italian, you know, I, I learned to cook when I was, you know, four years old, we were cooking in the kitchen. So um, it is it is great to see this kind of artwork that that uh, that's done. Um, tell me, I mean, I, in, in, in putting a show like this together, it's no easy task. And, and to make it different from all the other shows that are out there, um, what, what kind of hoops are they all jumping through? I'll start with uh, 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 Tamara. Yes. Well, I think the, the obvious difference is, well, the show from other shows is the fact that we have, you know, home bakers up against seasoned you know, professional bakers. And it was, it was awesome to see because there are sometimes, you know, uh, the amateur bakers, well, as, as, as Bill would say, this is a disclaimer. I mean, we have to <laughs> spoiler alert <laughs> there. They have beaten some of the professionals mm -hmm. and I, I love that message that, that we put out there. I believe in the underdog. And I also believe, you know, all you need is passion and, you know, practice and mm -hmm. you, you can compete with some of the best. And that is what you see watching the show. Uh, Bill is, is 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 cooking, baking, uh, all that becoming a sport now. Oh, that's interesting. Um, well, uh, yeah, I think so. I mean, I think it's uh, it's fun to watch. It's fun to see the details, and um, just like sports, there's there's so many millions of ways to run a play or to win a game, and likewise, you never run out of um, of sources, of ingredients, of imagination in cooking. So I think it, I think it is. Uh, I've even heard of chefs in uh, South America telling me that there's, it used to be like soccer players. Every kid wanted to be a soccer player, but now more and more kids are like walking long distances to go to cooking schools and they want to be a chef. Oh, that's so cool. That's my first Yeah, I think so. That. That's so cool, Bill. I'll ask Tamara, are you always surprised at, at the different types of, of desserts and bakery, that, uh, baking that goes on uh, in different countries. I mean, everything seems to have its own flavor and its own way of preparing. Yes, I discovered ube doing this show. I love, you know, sweet starches, <laughs> sweet potatoes, <laughs> yams, but I don't know why. I never knew that there, there was a purple yam that you can actually, you know, make into a, a, a pastry. And it was really cool learning that. My, my sister-in-law is Filipino, but I've never, I, I you know, I, I, I never saw that. So it's, it, it was eye-opening and it's actually one of my favorite desserts now. I think that's the beauty of, of the age we live in because we can all share these cultures and, and, and it doesn't seem so frightening, mm -hmm. um, you know, to, to be able to sit down in a group and, and experience international cuisines. Yeah. And the, yeah, as you say, like the guests in restaurants and, and the viewers of TV shows are open to these ideas. And, and I think that food television has, you know, is, gives credit for that because it's opened up a lot of people's minds about these new flavors, new textures new ingredients. And uh, that, that has to be a good thing. The rose member, I, I hardly ever ate like rose flavored foods because I was always like, I'm going to put that on my face, not, not in my food, but we right. had a lovely Indian, an Indian baker who made me a lover of that. In our final seconds that we have, I mean, you can be gifted all these wonderful uh, culinary tools, you know, mixers and, you know, and all that but it comes down to what you make with your hands. I really think that's where the love comes from. True. Oh, absolutely. True. And, and I say your heart, you yeah. know, you, you have to have passion for what you do. And baking is a form of, of love for me. Definitely. Well, and, uh, and good ingredients simply prepared will, will come through. It's always the simplest things that uh, make the most impact. Bill and Tamara, thank you guys so much for your time. Thank you, Tony. Thank you, Tony. You guys take care. Thank you. Bye.